Hello everyone, and welcome back to another Let's Card episode of Castle Crashers. We're on episode 3, and I accidentally hit the Let's Go Live button. <laughs> so we're starting a little earlier than I anticipated. I'm going to jump over here. Actually, I, for I didn't even get a chance to share this in the Discord. Let me do that real fast. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't know what happened. I'm my finger must have just slipped or something. Let me go over to... Here it is. You can go ahead and join at this point. Quip. Quip. Oh, wait. There we go. Yeah, I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> There's a button on the dashboard where you hit go live, and I, I clicked on it. I didn't even mean to. All right, and after this, we'll do the card stream again, as we've been doing each night. I'm, I don't ping them when I do that. I just post them going live. Alright. Sweet. Let me grab my character. You're like level 18. Why are you so strong? The TV is too loud, too. Let's see. Where were we? We were stuck somewhere. Was it here? No, we weren't stuck. We were just getting started. All right, let me turn this down too. I didn't even know if people still played this. Quick Quip and I are going through all of the best multiplayer co-op games together. That's what we're doing.
like the bonus agility I do. So plus three magic versus plus four agility. I do less damage. Side boob going on. <gasps> She's got one shoe. to like yeah I have to like manually remove the song YouTube do be like that <laughs> wait, wait wait this one's plus six well look at that that one's good for magic users this is plus one magic plus two magic plus seven oh I can use that I'm on 16 
game volume. It's too loud, says Wellix. Really? How can it be too loud? Let me look, hold on. Why would the game volume be too loud? I haven't changed volume. And we already lowered the music in the special effects volume. No, 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 don't, don't, uh... We'll just lower it more? It doesn't matter. It doesn't make any sense because I haven't changed any of my settings in OBS. Wait, could my microphone be too low? Hold on. Let me see if my microphone's too low. My microphone's too low. That's what's going on. Something's wrong with the mic. I need to think about this. This happened once before. What was the trick? You're speaking too quiet, can't hear you. Yeah, give me a moment guys, I think I know what's wrong. I'm gonna try and, uh, I'm going to try and fix it. What I remember is I had to remove micro. I had to remove the microphone from my PC, right? Your, your PC installs your, your hardware onto it. Uh, let's see. We'll go to sound settings. I remember I had this problem in the past. People are saying I'm talking too quietly, that's what's really going on. Manage sound devices. Input device. There has to be a way to remove the uh, Yeti. Hold on, give me a second, guys. I know exactly what you're talking about. There's a problem going on where I'm talking too quietly into the mic. But it's the microphone's fault. It's not my fault. It's a is a bug. One moment, guys. We'll figure it out. I think it's under Device Manager. Actually, you can start to look it up if you want. It's, it's, a, it's a bug. You can try to find it from your phone. It's a bug basically where I need to uninstall Yeti from, from the computer. I've seen this before, it's very annoying. Here it is, Yeti. Can I delete this? Uninstall device, here we go. So Yeti microphone is getting uninstalled, I found it. All right. All right, so I've reinstalled the Yeti device on the computer. Uh, the next thing I'm going to do, guys, I'm going to reset OBS. I'll be right back. Oh, my God. <laughs> All right, how's that, everyone? Oh my god. Oh, I'm so tired of having problems, man. I feel like part of this job being a live streamer is just solving a bunch of technical difficulties. Well, it says sounds way better. Yes, we're in the future now. Uh, not too far in the future, though, don't worry. My character's almost dead because I've been trying to get everything running the whole time. <laughs> oh, man. So tell me how it sounds and tell me how it... Um, well, obviously it looks fine. I was going to say, we're not having any kind of lag issues this time around. Oh. 
Who knows? How does that hit barely anyone? These bad guys, they don't they don't fly easily. Yeah, they don't. Huh, interesting. Whoa, that was a ton of damage. Oh, shit. Oh my god, I died. I know. Do they just... I don't remember if they actually show up infinitely. There might be a limited number of them. Oh my god. You're right, they don't fly at all. <laughs> Yeah, see, they're kind of, they're slowing down, see. There we go, there was just a lot of them. Pretty crazy, right? <laughs> Is anything in this tent? Uh, there was a weapon, remember? Ah, oh, man, it's so annoying that we were having technical difficulties. I think it's all fixed now, though. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, I was full, I wasn't even thinking. Oh no, these are ice guys. They're gonna take like no damage from me. <laughs> They're taking like half damage, it seems. Wow, how did more of these, uh, knights show up? They were just chilling back, you know? Alright, they were. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Are we getting to the reviving each other stages? How did that not hit anyone? Oh my god. Get him! Wow! I keep thinking that I'm going to be able to use magic and I, it doesn't. Alright, yeah, sip up my drink after that. That was terrible. You're three levels ahead of me? Frickin' frick. I'll protect us. You'll protect us? <laughs> I just walked into 47 damage. Die! Die! We all know I did all the work. She says, ah, too loud, TCC. What's too loud? What is too loud? The microphone or the game? Right, I've done a few adjustments again. You tell me what's too loud.
Undertale? Oh man, I'm not gonna make any experience in this part of the fight. I got the wrong damage type. Yeah. I'm dead. H A R P G says your voice could never be too loud. No, it definitely can be too loud. We want to get the voice, uh, the volume levels correct. <laughs> Let me go ahead and close this out. So that was device manager. I have the calculator open still. <laughs> Turn the volume down a little bit lower on my voice. You guys tell me if it's too loud, too quiet. I gotta get good feedback so that I can adjust the volume properly. I can hardly tell what's going on. My character is like the same color as their characters. <laughs> no, 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 you're, you're fine. Look at your character. Your character's not even maxed out on damage. It doesn't make any sense. Alright, here we go. My character does no damage to these guys. I suck. do any actual damage. What? He hit both of us. <laughs> I was wondering if there was more more experience you could make by hitting him over and over again, but there isn't. I think experience might be gained per kill. all agility next because it seems like I don't ever have enough magic to keep up with all the magic I need. Is he a stupid little faceless creature? Reminds me so much of like old Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles style games or like X Men. I'm dead. <laughs> Help! Wow, 
you're level 20. I, it sounds good. I will let you know if things change. Thanks, Lugs. I got knocked out again, dude. My character dies way too easy. I don't get it. Yeah, but you don't either, actually. I mean, you have more defense than me, but uh, I actually have some defense. Maybe I just ha have really low defense. <laughs> well, you're like three levels ahead of me. Of course you're going to have more defense. That's like six levels. I don't even know what happened to that guy. He's still alive. Dude. Oh, I hate these guys. I hate not doing any damage to them. Doing 30 to them? That's like what I was doing halfway through the game. I'm like doing nothing right now. Are we gonna play this again on crazy mode? <laughs> it's a pretty short game. Quip doing like 22 damage per hit and GC is doing 5. Oh, that's because I'm doing most of my damage with, with uh, magic, now with the physical attack. But the problem is, these guys don't take much magic damage from ice, I guess. Oh, interesting. This is dude. Oh my god, my first instinct was to kill it. <laughs> what does that tell you? <laughs> dude, stop attacking me! How did I still go down? You're like, smack, 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 smack. <laughs> they about to win. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Look at this cute little town from Undertale. Uh-oh. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> GC put most of his points into magic as Quip put most into attack. That's right. Shield and arrow. Can't guard the ice. Thing is, I get behind. Wait, how long does it take to break out of here? What the hell? Oh, I'm dead. That's why. That's annoying. <laughs> oh, 
<laughs> like creatures, how you call them? Oh no. Oh no, you should freeze them with your icicle, then getting close and do your uppercut power. What? What do you mean uppercut power? This? guy's a little bitch. Look <laughs> at that, that face he makes. Whoa! I don't know what my cat does, I bet it doesn't do anything. I know! Every time he's used that move, he uses it again. I'm, I'm dead. My character is so dead! He's dead! He says, wow, I almost didn't recognize Falcona in this cosplay. Oops, I'm not even paying attention. God, I hate this move. Me and miss you. Oh, my dear Lord. I'm dead. <laughs> How do you get out of it faster, too? I noticed that. It seems like I have to wiggle the joystick a lot more. Yeah, but, oh, I bet it is. I bet it's a part of defense. I don't know. I haven't been paying attention. Looks like your jumping attacks are really effective.
was so close. Nice. <laughs> Look at this. Awesome. Oh man, you're about to kick my ass. I got like one hit on me. <laughs> Let's gather up some of this gold. Here it goes! I'm dead. <laughs> are you trying to- are you trying to let me win? It seemed too much like you're trying to let me win. Okay. <laughs> I get the kiss from the blonde princess. I'm okay with that. What are you like, 20 levels ahead of me yet? So should I build defense or should I build agility, I wonder? If I build agility, my arrows do more damage. If I build defense, I stay alive longer. Yeah, but the magic actually runs out. You can't just use it infinitely. It runs out too fast. I'm almost wondering if I shouldn't have built agility at all and just put it on a defense. Alright, go ahead. Go ahead, Mrs. I am level 20. Oh. Uh oh. It's the Twinkly Star place. I was just curious. This looks like where you would fight the Necromancer. <gasps> it is the Necromancer! <laughs> Obviously, this is what I would have done. I mean, if you're good. How are we flying? That's why I don't understand. Ooh, maybe we should go back and, um... Let's go back to the map and change our little animals out. Neither of us know what the heck we've got. Wait, here's the store, too. What's this? Plus four magic? It would cost all my gold though, I don't care. I'm just gonna get the heals. Four, five, that's good. And you know what? Let's go back and check our little animals. What icons? Wait, 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 wait. The animals aren't here. Here we go. Snail burst does what? Increases your defense, but decreases your agility. So you do have more defense, plus you've put more points in the defense. All that makes sense. Look at this. Increases your strength and agility. I don't need this character at all. Like, even a little bit. What does the draft do again? Draft is for your level. I don't really need to level up faster. I don't really care. I, I maxed out my magic. So, this guy gives you gold. The horsey lets you walk in water faster. And the dragon spits fire. Let's grab the dragon for now. I'm thinking about doing the ram though. The thing is with doing the ram, I'm worried that the ram just kind of unfreezes them all. So I kind of don't like that either. Oh, I see. What does the bird do? Let's find out what the bird do. Secret items. This one feeds your food. Hidden fruit from trees. Yeah, I'll do the dragon. You're going to keep the snail? Yeah. You like him? Alright guys, we're on our way. This is pretty much near the end of the game, I think. Tiger gives agility and strength, snail gives defense, takes agility. This 
guys look like bad guys. Are they not freezing? Hold on, wait a second. Am I really doing runs to them? Oh no, they don't take magic damage? Um, hmm. I'm basically useless if these guys don't take magic damage. I can't. I, I'm like useless in this area. They don't, they don't get knocked down by arrows either. You'll have to get all the uh, experience from this whole area. That's not good. I didn't know this area existed. I don't know. That's a good question. I do one damage. Did I just take 21 damage? I'll just have to use my physical attacks even though I haven't upgraded them like once. Like seven. Six. Wow, if I was playing this single player, I would just be screwed at this point. I mean, this part of the game would be excruciating. For building magic. Yeah. Probably is though. Oh, what? Wow, look at that nice painting. Uh oh. I'm in your castle. This one's so weird. I will pay you the end of that corner. <laughs> I don't understand this bad guy, like, what is he? He's like this thing that they were thinking of doing, and then they went through with it. He's like something from Sesame Street. You're level 21, you're four levels ahead of me. I feel like th there's kind of like this snowball effect where if you get ahead, you just get further and further ahead. You know what I mean? Kind of like what? <laughs> That's a little bit accurate. Dude, when they blow up, they do like 100 damage. Projectiles certainly work. Have you tried your bow? I think your bow and arrow works on They never were pain. Oh no. Oh no. There's a creepy clown! Smack him up! You got him. The fuck? <laughs> All this money? He seemed kind of easy, didn't he? Bad guys are into fine art. Oh 
Okay. So now we go through the next door. Uh oh, you know where this is gonna be. Is this guy look? Hey GE, you and the young lady should get Resident Evil 2 remake and see who finishes first. Um, who who's gonna finish first? Should I finish first or me? Me? <laughs> oh my God, he's got so much range. I'm gonna make this guy run into you. That's the puppet sock from the dragon. The, the Cyclops down because he's, he's the only one who takes damage. Ow. Ow. How annoying. He really wants to smush you, huh? I like how they fly off as little ghosties. <laughs> we should go separate paths. <laughs> I like how the eyes like moving around. It's pretty cool. Have you tried jumping? There are three bosses to go, then the final princess, then insane is unlocked at like level 36 or something like that, says Scott. Really? Satan. Uh-huh, Satan. Oh, I hate this one. This one's awful. The Necromancer. You can, it's just, all of this is super confusing. They're all like magic users too, all these guys. He about to call him some more. <laughs> Look how friggin' fast they move!
<laughs> oh my god, we're both really quiet. We're like both concentrating. I know! He'll come down. <laughs> there he is. Now he's getting wrecked. The Necromancer is so funny. <laughs> I feel like I'm helping. <laughs> My magic's not coming back in time. Oh! Don't be shy. Take some more. <laughs> Don't be shy. There he goes. Woo! What did you pick up? Oh yeah, we've already got that. I can't use that one yet. Wait, you've got a magic weapon. You've been using the wrong mech weapon the whole time. Oh, really? Yeah. I should have been using this one. This one gives more defense. Now I have the Necromancer's... That one's not good for you either. You can be doing way more damage. Like a strength crit weapon. You want to go back and get it? Ice does the pillar. Ice does the ice pillar, which hit two, three times. The saw do not stop hitting. What? If you can make the enemy airborne, you can con combo them airborne. What? The paint guy they just beat dies in like five seconds or less. What? Where are we? I don't even know what's going on right now. Oh no. I think those are bad. The crystal? Oh, this is the evil crystal. Okay. This is what the uh, king had, but I guess now it's a bad guy. Did we break one? Alright, the next time we run this, it's gonna be a speed run. We have to get it done in an hour, the whole thing, from beginning to end. You're like, no, like, legit. <laughs> Wait, you can attack them in the air? Why are you doing so much more damage than me? Uh oh. Hold on, stop hitting him! Stop hitting him! I think you were damaging me. We gotta figure out how exactly the fight's working. So he's red now. That means you can damage him now. 
See, before it was blue. I, I think only I could damage him. <laughs> okay, okay, so you see, so you hurt him if you attack him now. Or you hurt me, is what I'm trying to say. He changes so easily. Alright, he's changing. Got him. <laughs> it's not over. Now he's in floaty mode. Yeah, you're like easy. Oh, my magic is still doing pretty good damage to him. problem. Stand still when he uses that move. Oh, that's your last potion, huh? God, so annoying.
figure out when you can punish him. I hit him occasionally, just not that often. <laughs> Traditional achievement unlocked. Hold on, it's not over. Quick, get on the crystal. We saved the final princess. Snack, snack, snake. Music and sound effects will stamper additional voices. Character portraits, Jeff Bandolin. All these people who's... Chip Burwell. Scott Fadik. Fadik. Poor souls, you forgot the sword. Aw. <laughs> Apparently there's a sword and we missed it. <laughs> Scott says, insane. What? It's not a dead princess, it's the last princess. So you've never beaten this with me, right? No. Yeah, we gotta, we gotta bring the last princess home. Forgot the sword, Gandorf wins. <laughs> you guys should have warned me earlier. Should have been like, there's going to be a sword at the end that you can miss. Don't miss it. The one reason to play the game and you forgot it. Oh my god. <laughs> and if it's too good, then it trivializes the game, if you think about it. Do you really? The one he was using? Are you <laughs> Bringing the crystal all the way back. And finally, thank you. <laughs> I don't remember. I think in the, back in the day it was like 20 bucks. Uh-huh. <laughs> no. Oh no. You're way ahead. <laughs> you only need to hit me twice. Yeah, you won. You gotta go kiss her now. <laughs> You're like, okay, where, 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 where? <laughs> Let me turn it up for you. <laughs> Keep watching. <laughs> Is it everything you hoped for? <laughs> uh-huh, that's, that's the whole trick with this last character. You never got to see her face 
so they could do this stupid joke at the end. <laughs> uh huh. I got to kiss the blonde one. That's all that mattered. <laughs> you got to kiss. You got to kiss the clown. <laughs> New character. Exus return home? Could we have always done that? Wait, how do you go to the insane mode? Insane mode? Warning. Oh, I think you have to push A. Oh. But I don't want to play with these characters. So wait, can you only play in the same mode with the characters you already started? Look at the little look with his eyebrow. Do you have to watch the opening? I think you do. Yeah, I think we might wrap up here. I, I would like to play insane mode, but if it makes you have to replay the entire normal mode with like new characters, I don't know if I want to do that. It sounds like a pain in the pooty. Look, I'm, I'm one of the guys. Look, this is the bus saw guy. Check it out. You have arrows, I think. Yeah. You're like lame. Does the bus all look fun? We'll trade places. We'll pick new characters and replay. Do you want to play this guy and you'll do magic and I'll do a different thing? You're, you're all done with Castle Crashers? You'll keep playing? Here. So let's exit game. We're going to pick two new characters. I just want to pick a, a cool one, she says. So this time, I'm either going to build strength or agility, but I think I want to build agility. Nah, I don't remember what they all do. So if you want to play magic, I would play this dude right here. The necromancer? And what are you going to build on a magic? Agility, you just put all your points in agility. I think that the pink one starts off good at agility. You already played them though. Let me look this up, I'm curious. Castle Crashers, best agility character. Why agility is the best. Agility is one of the four character attributes. Agility affects how fast a player moves, how fast their arrows fly, how much damage they do, how fast you can shoot arrows. Also makes juggling easier. It makes combo locking easier, makes alignment easier, and makes dodging easier, essentially making it replace defense entirely, as taking 25% less damage by tanking with defense isn't as good as taking 100% less damage by dodging. Yeah, that's such a dumb argument. Bow deals three damage and the player will move at a regular rate of speed. Da -da -da. The following weapons grant the best agility bonus. Cardboard tube, huh? I don't think it matters. I think you can pick any character for agility. Which characters have the best magic? Castle Crashers. The Red Knight does more damage hits than any other character as long as you're holding down the button. The Industrialist kills bosses in seconds, literally. Best magic for what situation? Red Blue Knight are great for mob control. Industrialist Fencer are great for bosses. Industrial Fencer is good for bosses. Hmm. 
So what are you going to be doing? Agility? What if we both did agility? I wonder what that would be like. Hey look, it's the cube guy. You ready? Just a little bit. How tired are you? How tired are you? Wrap up here. You want to just save here? All right, I tell you what, let's kill the bad guys in this little area and then we will get going. Oops. Here he is, the biggest stinky. Oh, that's the crystal. Uh-huh, he steals it from the king. And he turns it evil. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if I really want to play it again. Do you want to play it again? Not feeling it? You want to move on to the next game? I think that's smarter too. Alright guys, this is going to be the end of the game. Um... You know, I was feeling it. The moment we started, you can't just play through a game twice in a row like that. You gotta take a break. So what we're going to do, we're going to call this the last episode of the Castle Crasher story mode. We did defeat it. We were tempted to play around uh, with two new characters, but I think it would be better for us to move to a new game. If you guys want to recommend a game, you're welcome to do that. You could do that in the Discord or in a private message. Uh, we'll be picking out whichever game we want to play next, okay? I'm gonna thank you all for watching. There will be a card stream, and I'll see you guys next time.